Hi, and welcome to Lights Go Up and Lights Go Down. So, the short nose crank engine. You've probably been online and seen lots of horror stories about the problems with it and people having to change their engines and everything else. Um, the truth is, as long as when you're looking at the car, you're checking a few things out, you're not going to get bitten by it and it's not really going to be an issue for you. The most important thing is that once you have got a good one, um, make sure that whenever you get a cam belt or a water pump changed, it goes to the right place and they know how to change it because it is slightly different to any of the other MX-5s. I'm not really going to go into that today. I'm just going to tell you about how to, um, how to find a problem, work out whether you've got a short nose crank engine and go from there. Um, the short nose crank engine was fitted to the very early 1.6 Mark 1 MX-5s around about the first six months, um, which obviously isn't a bad thing because it means if you've got one, it does mean you've got an early MX-5s, so there's a few benefits with the early MX-5s, one being that they do tend to rust less than the later ones. Um, it'll also be a more valuable car anyway, just because it's that, that bit older. Um, also, the, um, the short nose crank engine is, to my mind, actually the best engine that was, that was fitted to the Mark 1s. Its correct name is actually lightweight sports crank, which as the name suggests, means it does have a lighter crank and as a result is free of revving, um, which obviously isn't a bad thing. So, how do you spot a short nose crank engine? Well, the first thing you need to do is get the bonnet open, look right down the front of the engine. At the bottom of the engine is an auxiliary belt pulley. Now this pulley will have, on the front face, it will either have four or eight slots. So this is two examples of pulleys that have already been removed from a car. These are the slots you need to look for. That one there is an eight slot, and that one's obviously a four slot. If that pulley's got four slots in the front of it, then it's a short nose crank engine. So the next thing you need to do is get the bonnet open, start the engine, and check that bottom pulley, make sure it's running nice and true. If it is, you should be fine. So what exactly is the problem? Well, as that pulley wobbles, it starts to wear the keyway in the crank, which locates on the cam belt pulley, which then in turn sorts out all your cam belt timing. As that pulley starts to wear, the keyway wears, and then your cam belt timing goes out. And what you'll find is the engine will be unresponsive and sluggish below 4,000 RPM. And unfortunately, the cheapest remedy is to actually change the engine. So if you are looking to buy an early Mark 1 1.6, make sure you check that pulley. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.